Hello YouTube, welcome back to the compound, welcome back to the pump track build right behind me. Loads of cool stuff's happening and welcome back to the channel, all you subscribers, the legend squad. All of you real dudes watching the videos, we're back at the compound and I've been away lately so the videos from the compound haven't been as frequent but there's been good reason because I've been at competitions, I won Swatch Rocket Air which was a sick contest and yesterday I was in Switzerland again for a contest called Bike Days where I came third on the podium. So I'm pretty stoked with the, the like contest calendar this year, how the season's going. But the thing I'm most stoked about in the whole world is this stuff behind me. So I'm stoked to be back here every single day this week, working away, producing sick time lapses, getting you guys involved with ideas. And that's where we are. So instead of just going straight into it and telling you the plan and what needs to happen and then starting from that, I've already done quite a lot of digging. So there's already time lapses ready to go for the start of this video. The other thing I've done is put a Muckoff logo up on this vert wall and it looks insane. Muckoff sponsor the compound, We've got logo on the vert wall, that's 15 foot high, it rides so good, it's kind of all attached to the trees which looks insane and got a big stencil made, so that looks pretty cool. So that's happened, next. I've increased the size of this wall by one course of blocks because I just thought I had leftover blocks, why not make it higher, get more speed for this section of the pump track. More height, more speed. Here's a time lapse of me doing that. I've also stacked up these rollers behind me, this kind of straight of rollers coming back. They needed to grow a bit. They shrunk when it rained, needed more wheelbarrows of sand. So I've added to that. And actually I need to kind of order a whacker plate in again to make that stuff go super hard because these ones here, you can hear if you listen. Concrete. This stuff works really good actually, mixing the sand with the tarmac planings. It's going on real good. So, as I've said in the last videos, we are really close to getting to ride now. Gonna get a whacker plate, harden up all that straight there. Ow! Oh! Just twisted my ankle. <laughs> and then, check out my new drain. Concrete. Add <laughs> it's so sick. This is where all the water from this berm is going to collect, go through that pipe all the way and join there and out the bottom. And that's just leftover cement from my new block wall. So, the plan, and it's not just a plan, it's already in motion, is to build this straight that Jig stood on. Jig and Sam Johnson got to work at the end of last week before going back to Switzerland. And we've started building this return straight after the hip. So after the hip, we've got this like boobed cambered roller and then we're going to do a split line, aren't we? We've got a tabletop on the side of the dirt spine, which is going to head that way for that berm to ride it that way. And then we're going to fan out the landing so it goes nice and wide. So you can go that way into the berm that way. So this is going to be a split. So if you ride the berm that way, you can jump the spine. If you ride it that way, you can come back down this straight. Obviously there's going to be another straight there. It's getting crazy. It's getting hectic. So. This has already started, as you can see. This roller has had the Sam Johnson wizardry of patting, shaping. He can just make stuff go a lot harder than the rest of us. He probably sneaks up here with cement and just makes everything concrete. We're going to carry on right now, literally right now, and you guys watch some time lapses of everything that I've done up until now. Because today's video, I want to fill it with progress, not just like a couple rollers, one jump. I want to have so much new stuff. So enjoy these time lapses. We'll check in later and we'll have more. Yeah.
We are going to need another 20 tons, that's for sure. And that's going to be total 60 tons used so far, which is pretty cool. And I predicted an 80 ton pump track, but I think we might be able to get by with 60. It's very hard to say. Very, very difficult to say at this time. It's hot. Fresh time lapse. So what you've just seen is almost two straights being formed. We've got the dirt spine. We've got a triple roller down below. Right there, so you're gonna come off the hip. You're gonna go bang, 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 triple roller. Then we're getting towards the berm here. This 180 corner, which mirrors that one. Now, it would be sick to have one more roller there, like really angled to get you into the berm. So that's what we're gonna build now. This tabletop's gonna feed the berm that way from another roller. So right now we're gonna build really cambered roller, line the berm with sand, roller out, boom, we've got a side to match that side. And then we have a pump track. Ben's turned up. What's up, Ben? What's up, Ben? potentially think that this has been the best pump track video yet with all the time lapses all the progress I'm pretty knackered out Ben's knackered out Jig's knackered out Phil turned up to ride with me another mate who's riding the big jumps with me later but he's helped this is where we're at this is what's happened we've got the rock hard roller here and then so much has happened actually this splits into tabletop but also you've got one two three and a fourth roller so we've got a quad roller network going on into the new almost 180 corner which mirrors that one both exit rollers are in i do want to make those bigger however we're out of sand what a miserable day more sand needs to be ordered so the new changes do look absolutely insane. Let me know in the comments further ideas. You guys see things differently to me. You see lines and options that I can't possibly see up here digging. So hit me, hit me up in the comments. Tell me what you want me to do. Here's another view from here. Insane video, I think. Unreal time lapses. It's looking amazing. That's taller. That needs to go a bit higher. And then we'll see you in the next bump track video very, very soon. Comment away with some ideas. You are all absolute legends. Thanks for following the pump track journey. It's been insane. It's looking insane. It's actually now a full loop. This whole thing can work. There's already lines forming. So let's get tires in the dirt. Let's make it happen. And I'll see you in future videos very, very soon. Peace out, guys. Legends.